hey y'all welcome to another weekly vlog my name is jasmine this is your first time here on my channel welcome don't forget to hit subscribe down below so today is monday um i'm off today wait is it monday yeah it's monday i'm off today so we're gonna be running some errands i just got done filming three videos because i need to pre-film for this week and next week i also need to edit today's this week's weekly vlog which was supposed to go up yesterday but i need to edit that today as well so i could have that up tonight or, or tomorrow either or um and uh, yeah so we did three videos so we've been pretty productive this morning i also have a lot of cleaning to do because my house is in shambles girl it's a wreck <laughs> like let me show you L look this is the living room i have sweater on the floor this I have this um what is this the, the mop that i bought i haven't even put it in the kitchen yet because the kitchen is a disaster my bag is on the chair like it's just a target bag it's just everything it's just uh i need a lot of I have a lot of cleaning to do i have a lot of cleaning to do a bottle of sierra mist on the the seal this is just crazy the folded blanket though <laughs> this is the only thing that's not chaotic in this room right now the folded blanket look is that goldfish oh my goodness oh. one of my children my children i've been working on my kitchen so i decided to do a mini um personal renovation of my kitchen i say personal because i did it myself i'll show you guys what i did i don't know if you guys remember what my kitchen looked like before i never really showed a full kitchen tour or anything like that but you've probably seen it in the background of my videos but i wanted to redo it and originally i was going to like professionally redo it but then for a long list of reasons i decided to do most of it myself and then um some of it i may do professionally i'm not sure yet though but anyways let me show you guys what i did so far in the kitchen because i'm really proud of it don't mind all the stuff on the floor a lot of the stuff on the floor back there is the kitchen stuff that i had to remove in order to paint the cabinets because i painted the cabinets but i had to sand down the old paint and that's why all the dust is in here from that the sand in the sander i had a mask goggles everything i wanted to vlog it but it was just a lot of work and not a lot of work to vlog but it was just a lot of work i was doing and vlogging makes everything take even longer than it needs to so i was like you know what i'm gonna just do this real quick it was not real quick it was hours of work but i wanted to just do it and also the dust on the camera i was like no let's just let's not do that <laughs> but but let me show you guys what happened so far again ignore Ooh, okay son ignore the disaster that you're about to see because the finished product will be amazing <laughs> so far i painted the cabinets they were a darker gray color i painted the cabinets into this color it's a white shade i forget the exact name but i have the paint in case you guys are interested in it but it's from bear paint from home depot but it's a whitish color it looks really really nice i also changed the knobs to gray um not gray gold i do have to fill these holes in because we had a handle before like this way and i didn't like that i didn't want the handle anymore i wanted knobs so basically i'm gonna fill this in with um a wood filler my dad has um and then once i fill them in i'm gonna just paint over them sand them down and then paint over them so i also changed the hinges to white so it could match better because i couldn't find gold hinges i also felt like the white would just look better it flows a little bit better so did that I ordered some tiles from Amazon, stick-on tiles, so I'm going to tile this whole thing. So yeah, I'll show you guys that and I ordered a new wallpaper to take off this yellow thing over here. I also don't mind the mess, don't mind the mess y'all, like don't mind this. Let me block it. I also painted the cabinets below. I also painted these cabinets below as well. So that's what I've been doing. I actually have a set of pans from Caraway that they sent over. I definitely want to show y'all, but how am I going to show y'all with all this mess? Maybe I'll show you guys in a few days once I clean up everything, but it'll be in this vlog for sure. I will definitely include it in this vlog. Um, I need to do groceries today because I got no groceries. I need to pack my bag, throw on a jacket, and head out the door before it gets too late. And I changed my mind. <laughs> All right, y'all, it's freezing cold in here, but I wanted to try this out. Uh, I got this at Target the other day, and I figured I would try it out in this car to see if it works. It looks like you just plug it into this. <laughs> One thing about me is I hate reading instructions. Let me see if I can figure it out without reading instructions, because if I can, I'll be happy. 
let me see settings let me go to bluetooth let me see if it works let's go to music oh let's play some rihanna since rihanna is having a baby with asap rocky we just got to cb2 while it's down here so i'm gonna park over here somewhere let's park um wait where should we park can you guys see that i don't know <laughs> let's just park over here though <laughs> i don't know if i told you guys i was going to cb2 but i am going to cb2 i want to get new kitchen stuff for my new kitchen you know so i wanted to pick up some um flatware just you know knife forks those things and um I want to kind of like start fresh with a lot of things to just um, revive the kitchen. So that's what we're going to do at CB2. Um, where's my phone? I know I have my phone because I was playing music. <laughs> okay, it's right here. So I just wanted to go in and the playlist I was listening to right now, like it's so good. If you have Apple Music, it's the um, Aaron... Aaron is the R&B now Apple Music playlist. They update it every so often, like they add new songs. But basically, it's just this playlist, and it's really good. Like I've been jamming to all the songs all the way down here. <laughs> it wasn't that long of a trip, but I'm just saying it was really, it's been really good stuff. Okay, so we're done we're done with cb2 i got the flatware that i wanted and i also got a couple other things that i've been eyeing for the kitchen from them okay so now i have two more stops i need to make um i need to go I need to get to Trader Joe's or Whole Foods and I also wanted to swing by Crate and Barrel. So I always forget where Crate and Barrel is on this road. I know it's on this road. I just really hope it's north and not south. Oh no, it's further south. So we just got to Crate and Barrel. I'm gonna run in, take a quick browse and then I'll be back out. I'm gonna get to Chick-fil-A right now because I don't feel like um, cooking, so I'm gonna go to Chick Fil A. So I'm back home. This is everything that I picked up from Trader Joe's. I'm gonna do a quick haul and show you guys what I got. I also picked up um, Chick Fil A for dinner, so that's that back there. And I need to put the lemonades in the fridge for um, Johnny and myself. So it's for everyone, the kids, and Johnny and I. All right, so I guess I'll just start over here. I got some lemonade um, for the kids for school. These are just juice pouches and I just got two packs so that um, it could last a couple weeks. I'm gonna empty out these bags because it's gonna be so annoying to go pulling things one by one. So I'm gonna empty everything out and then I'll show you guys once I do that. So this is everything that I picked up. I did a week haul so it's quite a bit of stuff but I showed you all the juice. I also got these um, apple strawberry these are basically applesauce um, packets which Kelly likes these and they're a great snack actually like soon as I steal them and I have them on the go but this comes with four so I got eight of those got some um, avocados I got some clementines for the kids got some of these cheddar cheese rocket crackers they clay loves um, like ch cheddar Clay loves these types of snacks, so I got those. Also picked up some cookies for them. These are just vanilla um, cookies. Got two bottles of coconut water. Got some pineapple juice in the can. It comes with, it comes with four. Got some orange juice. Got some uh, raspberries, blackberries, blueberries, and strawberries. I got all the berries. We are a very very delicious family. <laughs> I also got some grapes back there. I got this stir fry shrimp mix. 
this is really good it's a quick meal with some rice it's just really good or by itself to be honest you could eat this alone it's really tasty I got a couple um, marinara sauces I always like to have these on hand because it's like a quick meal with pasta got some jasmine rice got some alfredo as well I picked this up because I was hungry <laughs> while I was in there but I didn't even drink it anyways got that I got some cheddar packs because Callie really likes um, cheddar cheese so I got this I got some uh, extra cheddar as well got some pepper jack and then I got some turkey slices for like a sandwich I also picked this up because Valentine's Day heart shaped jelly beans I don't know y'all <laughs> next I got some potato chips for Callie she likes these, these are like Pringles basically I also got um, taco shells two boxes of those we eat tacos pretty much every week got some to-go meals the this one is the this one is the orange chicken bowl and then I got two of I got two of the butter chicken Honestly, they were out of a, a lot of these. Do you usually have so many options? But they really didn't have many options for these today. I guess everyone bought them all. Got some um, cranberry, white chocolate, and oatmeal. I didn't see the white chocolate part. I don't know if I'm going to like that. But anyways, I got those. Honestly, Johnny's probably going to eat most of those. <laughs> and got some sparkling lemonade and sparkling berry lemonade. This kind and that kind. I also got some meatballs got some mochi these are really good and then for meats we got we got some wild salmon um, ground turkey ground beef ground beef we got some chicken thighs and then some chicken breast and I also picked up some coffee cold brew um, back here we have some rolls these are just um, sandwich rolls and then I got some of this bread this is the sourdough bread I got this for avocado toast got some flowers hydrogenias and then this mix right here plantain chips sweet plantain and then regular plantain chips um, I needed some new black pepper so I picked this up for black pepper and I think that is pretty much it Oh, I went through this faster than I thought I would. And I think it's because I put it all out. It's just so much easier. But yeah, that's my groceries. I'm going to put away everything that needs to be put away. And then I'm going to show you guys what I picked up at Crate and Barrel and CB2. So it's a lot later and I finally sat down to show you guys what I picked up from Crate and Barrel and CB2. It's 7.30 at night right now. <laughs> but I've been on go. I've been trying to clean up the kitchen because it was so messy as I showed you guys earlier. So I'll kind of show you what I did while I was gone for the past few hours I did start the tiles because I couldn't wait but I do need to order two more packs because I didn't order enough um but yeah let's get into what I picked up at Crate and Barrel and CB2 so let's start with CB2 because I only got a few things from there um first things I was really excited for I've been wanting these for a minute but they were always sold out so they were in stock and really like fully in stock um this time around but I got these little glasses. They're called the Eva Coop, I believe, I think is how you say it. And I thought they were so cute. So I got two of these. I wanted to get more, like in case we have guests. But I figure if I ever have, like, something going on at home, then I'll just go and pick some more up. I got this other one. So two little glasses. And these are so cute, you guys. I thought they were just, I think they're just so cute. Like, I love the style of these. Um, then I picked up a little um, creamer container so this is really nice if you have I thought this would be really nice for it if we're having like Sunday brunch at home you could put the creamer in here and just pour it you could have it sitting on the table with like the coffee and everything else and then I got a vase for my flowers and I really love the style of this this is a Dina fluted vase I will have everything linked below for you guys <laughs> In case you're interested <laughs> so I got these and this actually matches these cups or glasses so I got this this is gonna go probably like on my kitchen table or wherever I want to put my flowers I will put my new flowers in here ASAP 
Um, yeah. And then, whoo! And then what I actually went in for in um, CB2 were um, flatware. So I got some new flatware. And this style is really nice. I'll show you guys a couple of them. I do have to wash these. Once the dishwasher is done running, I will go ahead and wash these so I can put them in the drawer. So um, I'll show you guys like the spoon, I guess, and the forks. I don't know. So this is one of the spoons here. I love the handle on these. This is one of the spoons. I love how skinny the handles are. And I'll show you guys another one. I love the handle. So yeah, I'm gonna wash these tonight so I can put them in the drawer. My hair is looking crazy back there. Then I went to Crate and Barrel. The first thing I picked up was this. I got this little candle holder and I thought it was so nice. I love the I love the detail on this. It looks really, really nice. Let me block the light so you guys can see better. Love the detail on this. I thought it would look really nice um, in my house. I got that. And then I got the bigger one for this. Um, and I got some wine glasses. I picked two of these up. And I love the style of this. It's like a um, flat. I love this. is called the Edge Wine Glass. CB2 and Crit and Barrel just know what they're doing. They just really do when it comes to like... Um, house stuff obviously that's what they sell <laughs> but everything is right up my alley love so I got two of those as well and I do have to wash these so I'm gonna wash them everything tonight hopefully then I picked up some bowls I got four of these and this is called the Mercer bowl and I wanted to get the um, the low bowls as well but they were not in stock so I got these for now and I'm going to go back and try to get them whenever they're back in stock. So got these. I got four. I don't know if I said that already. I'm not going to show you guys all four. It's the same thing. <laughs> but let me get into this bag. So I got the I got the other candle holder. This is the bigger one. So we have the little one and the big one. I thought it would be really nice like stacked like this. So I got those two. I don't know where I'm going to put them yet. Yeah, not sure where I'm going to put those. This will probably look nice. It will probably look nice here. I'm not sure if that's where I'm going to keep them. But I got that. I oh. <laughs> Then I got this measuring set. I forgot I got this. But this is like a little measuring set. And they're cups. So basically it's half a cup, a quarter cup, third cup I think. Yeah, and a full cup. So I love the aesthetic, really nice gold and brown. I love I love my gold and neutral. Then I got a Misto um, sprayer. This is basically to spray your olive oil, so you can spray it over your food or if you're cooking. And then I picked up oh my god the cutest little the cutest little thing. This is just a cookie cutter in the shape of a heart for Valentine's Day. I thought it was just really cute to do with the kids so I got one of those I probably should have gotten two because they're gonna fight over it but it's okay we're gonna figure it out girl <laughs> um uh, I also got a little scrub daddy so this color is apparently um exclusive to crate and barrel I usually see these in like orange and yellow I've gotten the yellow one a few times I think um but yeah they have this exclusive color at crate and barrel and then lastly I picked up and then lastly, I picked up some plates. So I think she wrapped two in each. So I got this square plates. I thought these were so nice. Um, this is the style. This style is called court. And they have dinner plates. Um, they have dinner plates. They have salad plates. They have low bowls. They have regular bowls. And they have little saucers. So I actually want to get, I wanted to get the low bowls from this collection. But I just wasn't sure if I liked the square bowl. I kind of like the round bowl more than the square bowl. But I do like the square plate. So I figure I would just combine the two to kind of fit what I like. And not necessarily just get it because it was in stock. So... So we got four of these as well. And that is everything I picked up at Trader Joe's and Crate and Barrel. I'm going to go ahead and 
well I can't put it away I'm gonna wash actually I'm gonna put my flowers in here and I'll talk to you guys a little bit later wait don't turn it off could you show them my Pokemon mask Your, oh okay Callie wanted me to show you guys her little Pokemon mask that she made this is for your face got my kids ready for bed and I'm gonna take my vitamins before going to bed I'm gonna try the mango smoothie I'm taking the ritual um, vitamins for women I'm just trying this out for the first time I also ordered this so this is new to me as well this is Mayo de Chiro in Nostal <laughs> wait inositol so inositol is supposed to be really good for pcos so i'm trying these out and then i take d3 i also have b12 i need to um get some more and i'm also gonna take my melatonin so i could be out like a light like a light <laughs> all right y'all and while i'm doing this i'm currently uploading files to my laptop <clears throat> to my laptop that way i can start working on um my last weekly vlog which is supposed to go up tomorrow hopefully crossing my fingers because girl i am tired so hopefully i can get it up for you guys tomorrow oh this tastes so good this is so delicious Friday. I haven't vlogged in forever. I didn't plan not to not vlog, but I just haven't. Um, so this past week I've been working basically. The last time I vlogged I think was on Monday or Tuesday. Maybe Monday. But I've been working so I haven't really been able to vlog. There's nothing going on besides me going to work and coming home. Um, but yeah, so today is kind of a snow day. Well, it's like a rain day. It's like kind of a storm. So the kids are home. Um, Johnny's home and I am home so right now we're getting I just got dressed I'm gonna go to Sephora I wanted to get Rihanna's new lipsticks because they came out today but also I have to get a couple more things from Home Depot for the kitchen um, don't mind the floor it looks crazy but <laughs> and the counter <laughs> everything still looks kind of crazy but um, it's coming along pretty well so I'll show you guys like a quick update before I leave and then um, yeah, we'll be I'll be able to vlog today, so I'm gonna hang out with you guys, which is always a fun, a fun. It's always fun. Okay. So did most of the um, white tiling, which looks really good. Um, I do have to finish this section right here. This part I didn't tile because we're gonna put on the hood for the stove. Right, it's right here. My dad's gonna install it today. I started filling the cabinets with certain things. I don't know if I showed y'all, but like I have my tumblers and stuff and containers in this one. This one I put plates. So these are some of the plates that in bowls that I'm gonna put in there. And then this one I'm gonna do like a mini pantry almost. So. Um, I'm putting like my spices, my spices, <laughs> um, other things here, and then snacks on this shelf, and then like kind of like food on the top shelf. And then this side, we're doing glasses and cups and stuff like that. I don't know what I was gonna say. <laughs> I guess not. Okay. Yeah. That's funny. To Home Depot. We're about to go in to Home Depot. Oh, that scared me. <laughs> um, Johnny's with us today. I don't know if I told you guys, but we're hanging out with Johnny. <laughs> so i'm back home my dad actually installed the um hood the range thing over the stove while i was gone it looks really good that's what it looks like it has a light it does have a light so we have some lights over the stove under here and then it has the filter for like when you're cooking so he did that we got some stuff from home depot 
picked up this for in between the tiles I got this wood um, filler so I can fill these little holes um, got some chalk paints for some of the tiles I'm gonna actually paint them with this because they're just too hard to reach for um, they're just it's, it'll be easier to just paint them like these right here I'm probably gonna paint with the chalk paint I also also picked up some more of these I got two so this one it can go from warm to cool so I'm actually gonna put this one in my bedroom the one in my bedroom I'm gonna put it in my living room and then this one I am gonna use somewhere else and then I went to Sephora, which I didn't show you guys in the vlog, but I did go. Here's my little Sephora bag. I just picked up all the new Fenty products. So um, I'm just going to sit right here and show y'all. They gave me my birthday gift because it's February and my birthday is this month. So I did get my birthday present from Sephora. I'm going to zoom my nails. All right. Then I picked up, I got, I got all the Fenty lip sticks the new ones and then and then I picked up this Dior lip glow I've heard really good things about these so I wanted to try one I got the shade cherry it's basically like this um, reddish color but it's very like um, what's the word not opaque it's very sheer but it looks really nice and hydrating so that's what I got from Sephora I didn't show you guys my outfit earlier but that's what I'm wearing my big black hoodie, some sweats, and this is the fit of the day. So I just put it on. I think it looks really good. I don't know if you guys can really... I think it looks really good, y'all. It's like a little tint on my lips. Not sure if it's showing up much on camera, but it looks really good to me. All right, y'all. So I just got done filming the fancy lip colors i just got the fil film in the fancy lip colors so i'm gonna edit that video because i want to get it out today which i have like one hour to edit hopefully i can do it because I'm trying to get it done um yeah so i'm wearing one of the colors it looks really really pretty i love this color um i think the collection in general is really really nice um i have five favorite colors from the collection which I shared in that video so if you want to see what my five favorites are check out my fancy beauty video it is many hours later I finished filming editing uploading my video so if you haven't seen my fancy video on the lip colors yet definitely go check it out see my thoughts um I finished some of the kitchen I did some of the countertop I mind the dishes I'll stand this way I did most of the countertop I still have to get I have to get some more contact paper because I'm not done yet and then I have to also do some paint touch-ups I have to cover this wire I just have a few touch-ups on this side of the kitchen the other side of the kitchen I need to paint and it has a lot more work to do which I think I'll get done within this month which hopefully by the end of the month everything will be done that's the goal February's project um yeah i need to go wash my face though because i do work tomorrow actually i think i'm gonna drink something i'll just use one of i guess this glass i'm just gonna make myself a little drink hey y'all so it's the next morning and i have my coffee here and i'm about to open up my caraway pots finally kids yeah please stop If you're not fighting for half an hour, then yeah. Alright, y'all. So let's open this up. I have it kind of upside down, I think. I'm not sure. But I just wanted to get it up here on my stove. Okay. So I just opened it this way. And um, oh, I think I'm supposed to take this out. Okay. Whoop. Another one in here. so good you guys oh my gosh all right let's take this out they all look so good i am obsessed okay so we got the gray collection obviously um and i think these will match the kitchen perfectly because i have a lot of gray in here like right there and then um on the countertop and also right here has some gray so yay i definitely cannot wait 
It comes with a saute pan, a Dutch oven, a frying pan, and then a saucepan. So everything that you would possibly need for delicious meals comes in this set, which is amazing. And then I think these are the lids on the counter. So I'm going to go grab my phone because I want to take some Instagram um, shorts, like reels with this. So I'm going to be right back. I just opened the full collection and this is everything. So we have the four pots. I put the lids on them. I definitely cannot wait to use these. This is the full layout of all the pots. Um, I'm excited, so excited. This is a storage for the lids. You wanna put the lids in here, you can do that to store them. And also they gave me some pot holders or um, what are these? The, the Not coasters, but I forget what they're called, but they're basically to put the hot pots on. Um, once you're done cooking and they also came with these little um storage things for the pots so you could put them to stand what i think i'm going to do is actually clean out this these two cabinets and make that my pot storage right now i keep like kind of like i don't even want to show y'all because it's a mess in there <laughs> but it's just kind of like cleaning stuff but i can keep my cleaning stuff somewhere else like in the garage make it really nice and store the pots there i believe that's my plan so yeah this is everything thank you so much to caraway they did give me a link so you guys can click on if you want to shop and get a discount um, this video is not sponsored but they did send me the pots so thank you again to them you guys will definitely see me using these pots for sure it's a little later i just wanted to show you guys um, my bottle rack it came in from amazon I have it linked below, but basically this has six spots for water bottles or any type of bottles that are too tall to store in these little cabinets or in any cabinet in general. If it's too tall, you could lay them flat. So I'm going to place this into the cabinet and then I'm going to basically lay the bottles sideways um, so that they fit perfectly. So I'm going to put this up in this cabinet right here I just put it up you guys I had to dismount it and remount like just one side because it wouldn't go in there so I'm gonna just place this bottle in so you guys can see what I mean typically this bottle does not fit because it's too tall but it's gonna go sideways I need to put the cover on as well but yeah I'm gonna put this one at the top <laughs> no, I'm, not. I'm gonna put this one at the bottom shelf and you can see it fits like this, which is perfect. I need to put the cap on though. Um, it's a Swell water bottle. This is the brand here, Swell. Um, but this one's pretty old, so I don't know if they still have this design. Um, but yeah. So the top shelf, I'm gonna put those glass Amazon containers. They could fit in there, I know for sure. Also, I chipped the paint while I was trying to fit this thing in there. <laughs> So I have to like tuck that up. So it's fine. I have a ton of paint left. And I'm going to keep a little jar as well of that color. So I could do touch ups throughout the kitchen if anything gets scuffed or anything like that. So it could stay looking nice for a long time. Today is Sunday. I'm getting ready for work. Um, I'm not really going to do much in terms of makeup. Just a little concealer in my eye because I feel a little tired. I'm going to use this one from Maybelline. This is the Stay Active. I still have not done my nails. I know, it's just horrible. <sighs> okay, so I'm going I'm I'm to put some lotion on my hands because they are looking hella ashy as you. It's like 6 o'clock in the morning. I actually need to be on the highway already, but it's okay. There's no traffic today. Well, at least it's like light traffic because it's the weekend. I was about to go make myself some coffee in the kitchen, but then I realized that um i have no creamer anyways i need to hurry up a bit and anyway, let me put some here there and i have this in the shade 50 by the way i have shade 50 in this concealer i just take this little um morphe brush this one m173 On my face, I have, um, okay, and for the rest of my face, I'm going to do sunscreen. I just put lotion on my hands, so I'm going to wait a minute, and then I'm going to just put sunscreen on the rest of my face. For lips today, I'm going to wear Forget the Feller it's from Lawless. This is the Lawless um, lip gloss, Forget the Feller. 
I'm ready. We're gonna head out the house. Um, I need to go make sure everything is in my bag, and then we're out. Sure, girl, you're 